All right, guys, so today I am opening a box of 1998-99 Upper Deck Ovation. So these are the chase cards right here. This is the Michael Jordan Game Worn Jersey. And then the Game Used Ball. So some of the items that you can get from here definitely is going to be the Jersey card. That is the chase card. That card can go upwards of $10,000. Uh, if you get it graded, obviously it's going to boost up the price. There's also uh, Jordan Rules cards in here. Uh, 1 through 5 is going to be uh, 1 in 23 packs. And then uh, 6 through 10 is going to be 1 in 45 packs. And then uh, 11 through 15 is going to be 1 in 99 packs. And uh, there's also uh, cards called Superstars of the Court. Those are 1 in 2. And uh, let's see, the last one would be uh, the rookie draft picks. So uh, you can get the regular draft picks and then also the golds. So those come about one in nine packs. So some of the key rookies in here would be, you know, people like Vince Carter, uh, Paul Pierce, Dirk Nowitzki, uh, Mike Bibby, Ty Lue, uh, who else? Uh, White Chocolate, Jay Williams. So. Uh, this one I got off eBay and uh, really just wanted to take a chance. So I sold some stuff and, uh, you know, I've always wanted to open a box like this just to try and get that jersey card. So without further ado, let's go ahead and try and go after it. I think the odds for it are like pretty crazy. It's like one in... One in 2,500 packs or something like that. It's pretty crazy. I don't, I don't even know if uh, all, all of them have been pulled. So I'm not sure. But in this box part in particular, there's 10 packs plus one bonus pack. And there's about four cards per pack. So I've seen one other video on YouTube. And there was a guy that opened a box like this. There were, I believe, uh, eight packs at the top, and then there is uh, foam, and then two more packs underneath, plus the bonus. So, 10 plus one. Let's go ahead and open this up. Like there was another layer of plastic just over it. Hopefully, but that's by the store because there's the original packaging, and then this is the plastic that was over it, and there is that. I don't know what you call it? The uh, detection you were to run out of the store with it. But here we go, let's open this up. There are the packs. So look underneath this protective block to find your free bonus pack in order to provide maximum protection for your cards. Two of your 10 regular packs have also been placed below this protective block. So we should have about eight packs right now in my hand before I lift the block. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All the packs look good. They don't look tampered with. I can feel already the bricking. There's eight. 
we'll go ahead and lift this up. Styrofoam, and there's three packs right underneath. So one, two, three. Three. So just to keep it in order, we'll leave those at the bottom and put the ones that were on top right on top. So moment of truth, here we go. I like to open them up with scissors. Let's look, let's just read what it says on the pack itself. Ovation, Premier Edition, Upper Deck, 1998-99, Premium Basketball Cards. Cards with look and feel of an actual game ball. Michael Jordan autographed game worn jersey cards. Michael Jordan game used basketball cards. Top 10. Redemption cards, sequentially numbered inserts. Michael Jordan autographs, bonus, look for Jordan game ball and autograph jersey card inserts. And the rules if you want to pause. odds and everything all right I don't feel a jersey card in here but you never know let's go ahead and open this up First card is Dennis Rodman. Second card, Tom Gugliotta. Again, there's four cards per pack in here. Allen Iverson. Last card is a Superstars of the Court, Antoine Walker, which has a holographic look to it. Number C20. Okay. Don't feel Jersey in here. I should probably weigh, I should weigh this stuff, but it's okay, we'll save that. All right, second pack, Sean Bradley. Next card, Maurice Taylor. And it does have that, you know, basketball feel, it's pretty cool. All right, so we have a rookie redemption card. These are out of a thousand, and this is actually considered the gold. So it's draft pick six of the Dallas Mavericks. So if we're looking at, let me see here. I'll set that down. Vin Baker, superstars of the court. Got that holographic feel again. C15. All right, so the sixth pick of the draft was Robert Tractor Trailer. So that would have been number 955 out of a thousand. We can no longer redeem those, unfortunately. always wonder like where those cards end up going you know what I mean 
All right, so this is pack three. And we have another rookie redemption draft pick number eight. I'll look at my computer to see what we have there. Oh, we got a die cut. Wow. Okay, we got a Jordan Rules, Michael Jordan, die cut, J14. So, one in 99 packs. Nice. We got the Jordan Rules. The 11 through 15, as I noted in the beginning of the video, was one in 99 packs. So that's the best card so far. You only get, what, 11 packs in this box. That's pretty good odds. Jason Williams, not the one that we're looking at as far as a rookie's concerned. That's the Jason Williams of the Nets. And then we have John Stockton. Yeah, let's leave MJ up for sure. Nice hit here. Edges look clean, no surface damage. That's a clean die cut. All right, so that was four packs in. This is pack number five. I don't know, we can still get lucky. I definitely would love a jersey card. I don't have MJ's signature in my collection. That's something I definitely need to add at one point or another. All right, so pack number five. First card we have Ron Mercer. We have Terrell Brandon. Next, we have Larry Johnson when he was playing with the New York Knicks. The Knicks got to the finals that year in 1999. Unfortunately, they lost to the Houston Rockets. Or no, was it? No, San Antonio, San Antonio Spurs, I believe, right? Yeah, it should be the Spurs. And this is the Carl Malone base card. Okay, we are at pack number one, two, three, four. Okay, so this is pack number five I'm opening. So three packs in, we were at Jordan. This is pack number five. We get Brevin Knight. I think the, the first card I pulled was a Brevin Knight, correct? That was a Dennis Rodman. Getting old, man. All right, we got a... No, upside down. It looks like Kobe, but... It's Eddie Jones. See, that six looks like an eight, and then upside down, I was like, yes, it's Kobe. But it's Eddie Jones. All right, so we get a Tim Duncan. This is his second year card. This is the year that he won the championship. And then right under that is Hakeem Olajuwon, Superstars of the Court. So we're making pretty good odds on these Superstars of the Court. One in two packs. And I believe they're just all holographic like that we got three superstars of the court so far with five packs in yeah, it, these boxes don't come cheap anymore unfortunately as time goes on these things get more and more expensive and you guys saw ooh. You gotta blame COVID was all I was trying to say, but here we go. Michael Jordan base card. 
two MJs. I'm happy. So we got MJ's base. We're definitely gonna have to sleeve that. Stefan Marbury. Probably one of the last times that he was in the NBA, huh? Before he made it big in China. You got Tim Thomas. And then right under that, we have Juwan Howard when he was playing with the Wizards. All right, so we'll sleeve up the MJ base. I would love a Kobe base card for sure. This is MJ number seven. Seventh pack. All right, Antoine Walker, first card up. Next, we have Reggie Miller. Right under that, Isaiah Ryder. And right underneath the Isaiah Ryder is Grant Hill. Pistons Grant Hill. All right, lucky number eight. Pack eight. Jerry Stackhouse, card number one out of pack eight. Next card, Jamal Mashburn. Next card after that is Keith Van Horn. And then we have Chauncey Billups right under that. All right, moving along, pack nine. Buying boxes, you take a chance. You just never know. It's either you open it, you invest it, leave it alone, right? All right, so we have a draft. Well, actually, it's it's weird how it was under packed uh, right side up. Anyways, we have uh, draft pick number seven. Did I go over? Okay, so anyways, of the Kings, draft pick number seven. I didn't let you guys know about that other card here, but I will go back. All right, we got a Reggie Miller base. Joe Smith. And then Grant Hill. Again, superstars of the court. All right, so pick number seven and picks number eight. Seven was the Kings and eight is the 76ers. Jason Williams, white chocolate was... Pick number seven for the Kings. And number eight was Larry Hughes. Yep, Larry Hughes. All right, here is pack number 10. Okay, 
Okay, we have Bryant Reeves. We have Corliss Williamson. We have Jamal Mashburn. And we have another base Jordan card. We will definitely sleeve him up. Some of the good things about pulling cards in its original form out of boxes and packs is that there's good potential, that there's no fingerprints, nothing of the likes. You know, sometimes you'll get surface issues. These ones look good. So, got two MJ base cards, and now we have the final pack, the bonus, pack 11. This is the last pack in the box. It was the one that was way on the bottom, and I don't think we hit, so we lost money on this box, but nonetheless, it was fun while it lasted. All right, first card, Lafonso Ellis. I would like a Kobe base though. We'll see what we hit. Maurice Taylor. And what do we have here? We have a serial numbered Penny Hardaway, number 398 of a thousand. And it's a gold, gold of a thousand. Penny Hardaway, that one's nice. There is some surface damage I see back but the front looks really clean definitely we'll sleeve that up and then we have the last card another Vin Baker superstars of the court all right so I'm not sure what the odds were for uh, the golds I might have to look back on the pack but here we go Two base MJs, the Penny Gold, and the MJ Superstars of the Court. So that's what we pulled. Thanks for tuning in.